into today's video on quantum key distribution, or QKD, and its applications in the real world. My name is Jamie Willett. I'm a consultant with Encryption Consulting. Encryption Consulting is an established data protection consulting practice that covers all aspects of the data protection landscape, such as encryption, data security, key management, and privacy. We help clients in understanding and implementing cybersecurity policy and practices based on their individual threat landscape. Now let's dive into our topic for today, quantum key distribution. Our focus for today's video will be an introduction to quantum key distribution. Beginning with the brief dive into quantum encryption as a whole, we will then cover quantum key distribution, including various protocols involved in QKD, followed by standard challenges faced by organizations in adopting QKD. Then we will go through some real-world applications as well as discussing a few active implementations of QKD. In today's world, where data breaches have become very frequent, cybersecurity has become more critical than ever before. Encryption is an essential tool that helps keep data secure and confidential. However, some traditional encryption methods have become increasingly vulnerable to cyber attacks. With quantum computing on the horizon, the date of traditional cryptographic algorithms breaking is not too far from today. Quantum key distribution comes in here. It is an emerging technology that offers a quantum future-proof way of encrypting data. In this video, we will explore what quantum encryption and quantum key distribution are, followed by their applications in securing data transmission. What is quantum encryption? Encryption involves converting data into an unreadable format that requires a specific key for decryption. Traditional symmetric encryption relies on mathematical algorithms to encode and decode data, using a public key for scrambling data and a private key for unscrambling it. In contrast, quantum encryption leverages principles of quantum mechanics. Here, information is encoded using quantum states of particles like photons. These states create a unique key for encrypting and decrypting data. Quantum encryption relies on the randomness and unpredictability inherent in quantum mechanics, rendering it more secure than traditional methods. Moreover, it could theoretically detect any interception attempts, further enhancing its security. As we continue our exploration into quantum encryption, let's delve deeper into quantum key distribution. Unlike traditional encryption methods, which transmit keys over public networks, QKD ensures secure key distribution exclusively between trusted parties. By leveraging the principles of quantum mechanics, QKD exchanges quantum states between sender and receiver to generate a secure key. Any attempt to intercept these quantum states would disrupt the communication, allowing for the detection of eavesdropping. This can be termed as a major differentiator when compared with traditional cryptographic algorithms. In essence, QKD revolutionizes key distribution by leveraging quantum mechanics to guarantee unmatched security. Stay tuned as we unravel the intricacies of quantum key distribution and its pivotal role in safeguarding communication channels. We shall also discuss them in more detail in upcoming videos as well. Moving on, let's now discuss various prominent protocols leveraged as part of quantum key distribution. Quantum key distribution, or QKD, relies heavily on sophisticated protocols to establish secure encryption keys. These protocols leverage the unique properties of quantum mechanics to guarantee the security of the key exchange process. This slide dives into some of the most prominent QKD protocols. The BB84 protocol, proposed by Bennett and Brassard in 1984, is one of the earliest and most well-known QKD protocols. It involves the transmission of quantum bits, qubits, encoded in two different bases, typically the rectilinear, 0 degree, 90 degree, and diagonal, 45 degree, 135 degree, bases. The receiver randomly chooses a measurement basis for each received qubit and communicates the basis choices to the sender over a classical channel. The sender and receiver compare their measurements 
bases to determine which qubits were measured correctly, generating a secure key. The E91 protocol, proposed by Eckert in 1991, exploits the phenomenon of quantum entanglement for secure key distribution. It involves the creation of entangled pairs of particles, typically photons, with correlated polarization states. Alice and Bob, the communicating parties, each measure the polarization of their particle in randomly chosen bases. The correlation between their measurement outcomes allows for the establishment of a secret key with the security guaranteed by the principles of quantum mechanics. The SARG04 protocol, proposed by Skarni et al. in 2004, is a variant of the BB84 protocol designed by overcoming certain security loopholes. It introduces the concept of decoy states, where the sender includes additional qubits with known properties to detect eavesdropping attempts. By measuring the statistics of these decoy states, the sender and receiver can estimate the level of eavesdropping and adjust their security parameters accordingly. The CVQKD is a type of QKD protocol that utilizes continuous variables, hence CV, such as the quadrature amplitudes of light for key distribution. Unlike discrete variable QKD protocols like BB84, CVQKD operates with continuous valued quantum states, enabling higher key rates and longer transmission distances. It offers advantages for practical implementations, such as compatibility with existing fiber optic infrastructure and has the potential for integration with classical communication systems. While quantum key distribution offers unparalleled security, it faces hurdles that need to be addressed before widespread adoption. Let's investigate some of these key challenges. Interference and noise. QKD relies on a delicate quantum signal. Unfortunately, these signals are susceptible to disruptions from environmental factors like fiber optic imperfections, background noise, or even weather conditions. This interference can corrupt data and compromise the key exchange process. Degraded key quality can lead to unreliable encryption and potential security breaches. Researchers are actively developing techniques to mitigate the effects. This includes advanced error correction protocols and signal amplification strategies that minimize noise without compromising the quantum nature of the signal. Current QKD systems face limitations in three key areas. Quantum systems weaken significantly over long distances. Currently, reliable key distribution is limited to a few hundred kilometers without repeaters. Speed. Generating and distributing keys can be a slow process compared to traditional methods. Infrastructure compatibility. Integrating QKD with existing communication networks can be challenging due to hardware and software compatibility issues. These limitations restrict the practical applications of QKD for large-scale networks, especially over the existing internet. Ongoing research focuses on developing more efficient QKD protocols, improved single photon sources, and novel techniques like quantum repeaters to extend transmission distances. The lack of standardized protocols and interoperability between different QKD systems creates a barrier to adoption. Currently, different vendors may have incompatible implementations, hindering seamless integration and network-wide deployment. This lack of standardization makes it difficult to choose, implement, and manage QKD systems from various vendors within a single network. To solve this, establishing an industry-wide standard and protocol is crucial for ensuring the interoperability and promoting widespread adoption. Organizations like the International Telecommunications Union are actively working on standardization efforts. The final hurdle to adoption is the cost of maintenance. Setting up and maintaining QKD systems can be expensive. Specialized equipment, skilled personnel, and ongoing maintenance costs can be significant hurdles for some potential users. 
The high cost can limit the accessibility of QKD for a wider range of organizations and applications. However, efforts are currently underway to develop more cost-effective QKD solutions, including advancements in manufacturing techniques and the use of readily available components. Addressing all of these challenges will be vital for the realizing the full potential of QKD and establishing it as a cornerstone of secure communication in the quantum era. Collaboration between researchers, industry stakeholders, and policymakers will be essential in overcoming these obstacles and advancing the field of quantum communication. Quantum key distribution offers unparalleled security for transmitting sensitive data. Let's explore some of the most compelling applications for QKD across various industries. Starting with secure communication. QKD ensures secure communication between any two parties. It establishes a secret key known only to them used to encrypt and decrypt the data they exchange. Unlike traditional encryption, any attempt to eavesdrop on the communication will be detected due to the inherent properties of quantum mechanics, rendering the data unreadable. This makes QKD ideal for protecting sensitive information exchanged in areas like government communications, corporate secrets and intellectual property, and critical infrastructure control systems. Financial transactions are the backbone of our economy, and they involve highly sensitive information like credit card numbers and account details. QKD can create a secure channel for transmitting financial data, ensuring protection against unauthorized access and data breaches, increased trust and security in online financial transactions, potential for new financial services that rely on ultra-secure data exchange. Healthcare applications. The healthcare industry relies heavily on electronic medical records containing highly sensitive patient data. QKD can safeguard this information by creating a secure channel for transmitting EMRs, protecting them from unauthorized access by hackers or malicious actors, potential breaches of patient privacy, and ensuring patient trust in the security of their medical data. Military communications. Secure communications is extremely important for national security. Military operations rely on the safe and confidential exchange of information regarding troop movement and deployment strategies, battle plans, and classified intelligence. QKD also offers an unbreakable layer of security for these critical communications, safeguarding sensitive military data from espionage attempts, interception, and compromise. These are just a few examples of QKD's transformative potential across various industries. As QKD technology continues to evolve and overcome challenges, it holds promise for securing our most critical communications in the future. Quantum key distribution, or QKD, is no longer just a theoretical concept. Let's dive into some pioneering real-world deployments that demonstrate the power of QKD. In 2007, a landmark collaboration between the National Institute of Standards and Technology and the Los Alamos National Laboratory successfully implemented the BB84 protocol over a distance of 148.7 kilometers using optical fiber. This was a significant milestone showcasing the feasibility of QKD for practical applications. Another notable achievement came from collaboration between the University of Cambridge and Toshiba. They developed a high bitrate QKD system using the BB84 protocol, demonstrating the potential for faster and more effective key distribution. In 2017, researchers at the University of Science and Technology of China achieved a remarkable feat. They successfully transmitted entangled photons over an impressive distance of 1,203 kilometers. This groundbreaking experiment showed the potential for long-distance secure communication using QKD. A major leap forward came forward in 2018 with the introduction of the first commercial quantum network within the United States by Quantum Exchange. The groundbreaking network spans a massive 1,000 kilometers of fiber optic cable connecting 19 strategically located co-location centers. Along the corridor from Boston to Washington, D.C., and major metropolitan hubs, this deployment demonstrates the potential of QKD for large-scale, real-world applications. Let's 
conclude today's video with the understanding that quantum key distribution is an emerging technology that offers a future-proof and ultra-secure way of encrypting data. QKD is based on the principles of quantum mechanics, which are inherently random and unpredictable, making it much more secure than traditional encryption methods. QKD can be used to secure communications, financial transactions, healthcare applications, and has applications in military communication as well. This brings us to the end of our topic today. If your organization is looking for more information on quantum computing and assessment, please reach out to info at encryptionconsulting.com for further information. You may also visit www.encryptionconsulting.com slash contact us and leave a brief message. We post content frequently, and in the coming weeks, we will have more presentations on quantum cryptography, so we encourage you to subscribe to our channel to stay in the loop. Thank you. Thank you.